All right, game starting. Bottomless Bimbos, green, FYG, on blue, and I can't remember the last thing. Oh, oh Muppets. Muppets, there we go. There yeah, we I go. forgot that. Green's doing a pre-game dance. Cameron's flashing <laughs> the light. <laughs> Also, this game, who's going to take it out? FYG has been playing an interesting game. Mm. Their first game and their second game, not what I expected. They're playing more of a, a heavier D. Mm. What bases were they on? Uh, red on the first and green on the second. I just played two games with them. I yeah. just see lights. It's not mine, I shoot. Blue obviously taking that lead to start. So they have three in blue. Uh, maybe two more should pull their trigger. Got a player there, there, and there. That'd be interesting. Yeah. Wait, where's our? Th where's the third? I can only see two on each. I see a light there, a light there, and a light there. But well, that's not the base. It's just the base. <laughs> I'm just. Yeah. So yeah, so bases um, are crucial um, in the game. Um, Four thousand and one points, five five hundred for each tag. Getting tagged, yeah. As you put tags in, you lose your points that you put in. Yeah. So risk and reward sort of strategy to go for bases, but it is an easy payout if you successfully take one. Very much. So. And I guess it also gives that incentive to deny because it's more than just the stopping the player of getting those mm. points. The denials are two hundred fifty for one shot, and for two shot denial, it's five hundred. We have no caps. Generally, nationals do have like a zero point cap. I think. Really? I think they did introduce it at one point. It's still in. Wait, so, so there was a cap, yeah. But a couple of years back, they put a cap on it, so you couldn't just keep farming someone for denial. I could I waste, be wrong. I wasted a lot of time in that game. Well, uh, I think anyway, right now, we don't have caps. <laughs> okay, no, no, um, no, no but yeah. Oh. There you go. I didn't know that. It was a rule at one point. I don't know if it's still in the rule. idea of that. The blue still railing on that pack, but just lacking that base as soon as they do. Oh, red just got a base. Ooh. Yes. Taking green. Looks like red has moved to green and avoided that blue. Well. Looks like no one's trying. Ooh. Oh. Isle. And that would have probably been one of the sixth players that are not on the board. Because uh, we actually have six players on some teams, so oh, they will okay. not be shown on this board. Yeah. That's why there would have been a denial, but you wouldn't have seen who was Yeah, I was team. looking for who was, didn't I? Yeah. Still in it, they're not far behind. Mm. They, they're up on pack. They're holding the pack for sure. It's, yeah, FYG. So they're holding a strong D. Yeah. Does look like green at least was at blue. Yeah, green. Okay, there's someone attacking green now because green's yeah. just come out from pushing attack. Mm. Um, our base green is very unique in a sense of if there's no action, you can push out so yeah. far very and still so. have cover. And that's one of the good things. And I think that's one of the worst things about green is the fact that you need to be pushed out to be getting mm. those packs yeah. if you're too conservative with that defense then you're just going to fall behind yeah 100 percent. yeah it just yeah won't like the bases just won't play off enough just because of the amount of pack that you are getting out on got one green defender i think there was one attacker oh no it yeah. looks like there's two red's yeah, down there red has just yep jumped into yeah red's in back door yeah green oh it's two Like green's about to secure their green. And there we have it. Is that Yaz back? That was Yaz, yeah. Yep. Oh, no, that was no. Trav. Trav, there you go. Okay. Oh, no, Yaz is at home. That's why we can hear him. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Should have heard that. Yeah. <laughs> We're still, still in it. Still in it. No bases, but still in it. As soon as they start to get a base or two, they'll well and truly I think might. think Spider's trying to just 
torture as much pack points as possible and just test the so. limit. Yeah, and that's the thing because yeah. if they if they drop no bases at that five six minute mark, they can definitely pull out because they're well, they're all going to be needing blue. Obviously, blue mm. has dropped one to Zam, but no surprise, Zam is quite a machine, quite unstoppable. Maybe they're doing something similar to what they did last game, where mm. they dumped last couple of minutes. I think it was two and a half minutes in they dumped. Yeah, yeah, because that's yeah, when spider, we got hit at red. Yeah, spider pulled all these players. Uh, that's when our guys were down in green. Mm. One blue, one in blue. Green as well, and truly got all back up there. Oh, no, nope, red. Oh, I was about to, thought about to get commentators cast there. That was Trav. <laughs> Looks like Green is still holding. Hopefully, the hopefully the red players have pushed yeah. out for Green to push out like that. Yeah, I think they have. Yeah, that's the only reason you would bounce like that. Oh, they still got back door, so Looks like still Red's getting coverage. busy. Yep. Is that a, yeah, is that a blue? A green? Yeah, green? No, it's blue. Yeah, no, that's a blue. That was, yeah, uh, there so we far. go. D Dart. Okay, Hang so they basically blue. traded bases there, yeah. so. Red's still up there. Blue's not far behind. Mm. Two bases and they're back in. Essentially. They're down three paces, but they're up at least one base. Just about one base in pack. Red does look quite messy at the moment. Blue's quite vacant. Like mm. They're just walking around trying to figure out what to do. Probably waiting on a comp from Spider. Spider oh, hitting and Spider taking. Yep. Pretty clean base. He took it from Reload, didn't he? I think so, yeah. yeah. He's taken from there quite a number. Being a lefty, it's very easy to hit that mm -hmm. shot. You can have your back against that. You just extend and reach. Yeah. You don't have to really do anything explosion. As a rider, you sort of pivot and in a bit. Closes your shoulders and... These are a bit. I'm I'm start, starting to notice a lot more people take from that back spot in red base, mm. um, and I think it just capitalizes the importance for having someone in that V area near that triangle because mm, it's yeah. only a couple of steps over until you can shoot them because they're quite open from back door. So you've got to really make sure that you know what's going on at back door because if you don't, you'll yeah. Okay, so Greeners looks well and truly have locked red with three players there. Oh, yeah, four. Doing a switch. Oh, yeah. It looks like it might be dumped because there was one up front. Wildcard shooting red. I think red's dumped. Yeah. Yeah, they've dumped. Green's well and out of their base. They need to send Lady Midnight down to, to green to secure that base. Mm. Being a new player, she can disappear for a comma. Labyrinth. Yeah, and you'll we'll realize where they are. Yeah. 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 <laughs> if green power through bases quickly, they can still get up a second. Yeah. Like, yep. There you go. Thanks, sir. Yeah. Second's gotten his blue just then. That was Cool Beans getting red. It does seem like not a lot of people are going for that green base. This is, I feel like it's almost going to work out quite well for blue here. Because as soon as red has cycled, they only need one more green. And as soon as that's done, they've already got two blue. Mm, they've it's providing they go well. there, their blue might dump those um, bases back. Two and a half minutes left. Oh, blue got taken. Yeah, has got his blue. They definitely need to get Lady Midnight that green. If they do, I think it will it should put secure Blue in easily. quite a hard position to be able to take it back. Um, green, re green player returning. Blue, they would have to do a split. Yeah. They'd have to do a split dump to get this back. 
three minutes, four bases. It is possible. Mm. Um, Blue also, I believe, has they have six players. But they uh, only have five. Princess was out. Uh, they will have five. Um, they will have um, the gentleman just at the start of league. Yeah, and he would be Robocop. Yeah. Oh, he's going for red. Here you go, Robocop, taking red base. Uh, we got red down in green. There you go. Yeah, it's Lady Midnight. She's shooting yeah. it. There you go. So it does look like it will lock green out at first. Um, but definitely it does look like there's quite a free fight for second. Yeah, red's pretty locked in. Second and third, not too far behind. Yeah. Ooh. One shot deny. Red did the split dump. Yeah. Probably kept three at blue and just took down maybe Tuscan and Lady down. Yeah. Blue picking up their final red base. I think this locks it in. I think it's going to be yeah. red, blue, green. I don't think there's enough time to do anything. I think it has quite locked the scores mm. at the moment. Red has... I feel like red knows they're going to be comfortable. Nine bases in. They're going to be pretty comfortable with the situation here. Yeah, definitely. Knowing all their bases are pretty much all gone. They're going to be railing on the back. Spiders call blue to green. It might be a little bit too late to be able to secure first, but... It will definitely secure that second. I don't think they can... There's not enough time oh, for, for green. But Muppets have been doing really good this whole this Very much last so. few weeks, yeah. yeah. yeah Two that's... shot denial on Sulphur by wildcard. Not in my base. Pretty much. <laughs> It was a little bit closer towards the end. All, all green needed was another base, and yeah. it would have been up there, but blue just railed on pack. Yeah, very much so. So I think. Spider was on 15k, one base. Not 15k. 15k. The 15k, one base. Yeah, so red definitely pretty comfortable win there, mm. securing nine bases, which is quite good, um, considering that. Uh, a lot of players get towards that 9-10. It usually does stick around that 6 to seven, 5 to 7 mark mm, yeah, uh, in most cases. So yeah, they've done really well to get those bases and probably responded to um, to the moves of both green and red quite well. I think for blue to have secured that first, they definitely needed to pull down to green uh, a little bit earlier yeah, at that 3 minute to go mark. Probably a split dump a little bit earlier. Yeah. 3, 3 and a half minute probably would have been ideal. Yeah. I would have given them 7 bases roughly if they timed it perfectly, but they didn't need the 7. And I think I did notice screen was quite empty um, mm. for about 2 minutes before there was actually a player that yeah. capitalised on that dump, so yeah. maybe there was a bit of uh, missight, maybe miscommunication, maybe just didn't realise. Maybe green um, were posted really far out. Maybe they didn't yeah. actually... And that's the thing with green, because it is such an aggressive an aggressively defensive base you can push right out um providing you're not being hit there's yeah definitely a lot of potential Princess, there. are we in this one uh, uh we're in this one all right guys we're going in thank okay. you very much thanks guys see you later